Hello and welcome to your weekly Excel tutorial with Dave. Today we're going to talk about displaying formulas in cells rather than getting the result from the formula written. So you'll notice here that I have these formulas for the AND video, all in exactly the same, you can go check, and they display equals AND. So we have the string here, but we also have the formula here and the result of that formula. So when I go in, it comes back with true on this particular example. How do we do that? Well, there are two ways you can do that. You can start with uh, an apostrophe, or you can go into the actual cell formatting, which is actually on the home bar, uh, and you can go all the way down to the bottom and format as text, or you can actually go into cell formatting. So format cells, if you right-click, and go into this menu and select text and hit OK. Uh, so once you've formatted the cell as text, you'll see it here as well to validate. Uh, what we have is the apostrophe will allow you to go equal sum 5 comma 2. Uh, the result of this formula should be 7 because we're adding the argument 5 with the argument 2. So I hit enter, but it shows me the text, and you'll notice that in this, in both of these actually, the formula that we type in will show up as text even though it's leading in uh, and tells us which arguments are appropriate. You'll still see that it gives us the formula. But you'll also notice that it doesn't automatically format. Uh, so I've typed uppercase and I've typed lowercase. Uh, the actual format, and you can see that here, is all uppercase letters for these functions. However, if I type the exact same function into uh, cell D6 here, while the format is still general, uh, Excel will pick that up as a formula and it will format and give us the result rather than giving us back the string. And you'll notice that I typed that in as lowercase sum and it appears now as uppercase sum because that is the actual syntax of the function. It should be all upper. If you found this video helpful, if you like this video, please subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments or send me a message and I'll get back to you. Thank you.